Good morning everyone, my name is Freezed, and in this video I played 400 hours of War Thunder. This is the latest video on an ongoing series, and if you have seen it, then welcome back, and if you haven't, then no need to catch up. Although you can if you want, and it helps the algorithm. Anyway, we've got highlights, we've got lowlights, we've got a progress update, and the actual Gaijin moments this time, not just a clickbait title that I used, so let's get into it. And it all starts in this clip in the 109k4, with no game sound for some reason. This is going to be quite a big video, so sit back, relax, and I hope you enjoy. Oh, he is mad. Just gotta line up the shots. Oh no, that's missed. Clean. This is a bad idea, but I don't care. Oh, nice. Easy hard carry. I'm just gonna ram him. Oh, okay. Thanks. These ducks cannons are a little annoying when not spaded. Ah, no! <gasps> oh, okay. Bro, what is this guy doing? Come on, at least, at least play a couple games and props before you buy a jet. Serious? I swear these A4E players are so bad. Well, there's my point. Their tracer bullets are really bad in head-on, because you can just kind of... Yeah, that. And... We don't miss. Let's go. I'm just gonna play really suicidal, because it's an ME262. Might as well already be dead. He's got a lot more energy, though. This... this isn't... At least it looks cool, but I mean... Yeah, wait, wait, maybe we can get a reversal in, actually? Oh. Oh, you love to see it. Now I just gotta finish it out with these god-awful 30 mils. Please. What the hell? I didn't even hit him, huh? Come on. Get up. Oh, yeah, that's an overspeed. Nice. Oh my god, the Giga Chad's in a B29. Just on the runway. <laughs> Let's go. You got this, big boy. What a sight to behold. That happened to be last video, didn't it? <laughs> uh, wait, wait, did he just? Yeah, that's all six of his missiles are two seconds at the same target. <laughs> oh, well played, sir. Uh, uh, I think I'm gonna overshoot here. Stop! 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 stop. <gasps> Ooh, that's. Oh. What? What the hell did I just watch? I don't even think I can reverse if my whole plane is just yellow. Oh, now we're dead. <laughs> oh, yeah, great landing, bud. Maybe think about skill before you buy a good premium. This is a horribly scuffed landing attempt. We should be chilling, though. Yeah, yeah, we're fine. No. This fight is very cinematic, if nothing else. Oh, I might actually be able to reverse him. Oh, okay. <laughs> yeah, cool. Well played. Did I seriously just get Rick robbed by this guy's name? Yeah, I, I'm not going to take that one sitting down, bud. You deserve that. Oh, that was not a good time for him to activate that. Oh yeah, we did just steal it. Oh well, get some free SL in, why not? <laughs> what 
<laughs> we got him to overspeed. Oh, beautiful. This plane is so stupid. Why did I think spading this was a good idea? <laughs> it's, it's, it's got a 1.7 mil. 1.7 mil in the front. <laughs> yeah, the rockets were kind of useless this game, but that's alright. Oh, this landing is gonna be a pain in the ass. Yeah, every time I flip my planes, I just instantly die, so I don't want to do that. No! Oh, we were lucky. Hit him. Don't want to do that. <gasps> oh. Okay, we were lucky. This should be kind of a free kill. This thing's almost spaded as well, which is good. What just happened? That's ping. Oh my gosh. Yeah, I'm not very good at flying this, I'll be honest. Please. Crits. As if. <laughs> no way! The guns on this thing are so satisfying once you get the upgrades. Okay, I say that, but we're just gonna hit. This guy's probably gonna steal the kill. Watch. No. Please. Oh, there's another one. They're gonna get it. Gotta get the snipe. How haven't they killed him yet? Yes! Let's go. Wow, that's the cleanest kill yet. I still don't really know how to fly this thing very efficiently. Oh yeah, no, I'm gonna have to fight one of these guys, aren't I? Uh, not if he does that, though. I'm just gonna take the head on with this thing, because I hate trying to fight him in up tiers like this. So dumb. Cleaner than my search history. Nah, these cannons are so low velocity, I'm gonna need them to like fly into my rounds or something if I want the kill. No way! Oh, the boat's landed. Ow, I don't know. Oi! Don't kill me! Whee! I reckon I just try to take the head on because I got much better guns, much higher velocity. Yeah, beautiful. Now we just wiggle around a bunch. I don't think you'll be putting that out. I hate trying to put out fires in that thing. Any day now. Bye bye. <laughs> you got killed by an AI. You'll be stupid enough to do that. Actually, I think I might have. I should not have said that. I am so dumb. Ah! Um, that's not good. Oh my god. I'm sitting here in complete shock. I'm so stupid. I managed to accidentally buy a helicopter in the sales. Like, I don't even know how I did this. Like, uh, how? So stupid. <laughs> and because I bought the J288C, of course I killed quite a few people in it. Here are some of the highlights. A mob we can laugh at players like this getting smoked by bombers which are sitting completely still on the runway. It is important to remember that we are going to have loads of our own. And hey, luckily for you I managed to record all mine, so enjoy. Hey, there we go. That should be a spaded then. Oh, someone's salty. Uh oh. 
Oh, they actually hit me. I'm feeling really petty right now, so I think I'm just going to go fly into the ground and let them take the kill credit. Yep. And let's pretend that we're just going to be killing ground targets. And... Oh, there's a house! Uh huh. Eat that. Oh, there's a frog down there. Might go see if I can end him. Come on, buddy. Oh no, I, I forgot about those. Yeah. Ah. Wow, guys, look at this rare occurrence that I'm capturing on camera. Gaijin servers are having... <gasps> difficulties? No. Yeah, we're just getting kicked back to the menu, aren't we? Woohoo! Alright, the wings hit a bit, but I reckon we can still kill this guy easy. Because we've got a ton of speed behind us, so we should be alright here, right? Oh, I forgot. That's so dumb. Seriously? Bro, I swear, Wyverns are so annoying. Oh wait, there's a guy behind us, isn't there? Oh, I hate how like does the stupid damage like that. That's so frustrating. Editing me, by the way. What I was talking about here, because it wasn't very clear, is that little spin right there. How it's just like not smooth, and it's just really frustrating me. I don't know. I was dead anyway, but still. That's one of the dumbest mechanics. It literally just ruins the fun of the game. Serious? It took me like 10 minutes to get this back here, and you're just telling me this now. Come on, that's that's not on, Gaijin. Editing me here again. Another consistent source of frustration is having dogfights, which are like a minute or two long, just having it kill stolen at the end. This one was probably about a minute long, and I actually felt quite good about it, which is why it was all the more frustrating. This one lasted even longer, I don't remember exactly now, because I didn't get it all on film. But it was a really good low speed fight with a Yak 3, well you can probably see that, but what you can't see is the guy coming in from below, only to just... Yep, gone. Hooray, thank you. And this one here probably boiled my blood the most. It was against a P-51D on an EC map for some reason, even though it was an Air RB. It was a solid five minute long dogfight, hiding and running through the clouds, genuinely both trying to use our engine power to our advantage. We got in a couple of skirmishes like this until one of us broke off each time, until eventually we were in the final scenario and I was actually pulling over about to get the kill. And then teammate just does that. Like, I was literal seconds away. I cannot explain how frustrated this makes me. Five minutes of my time. I didn't get a single other kill in that match, by the way. 30 minutes wasted. 30. It's... Dude, it's just the most annoying shit. I... I just don't like it. Really. It feels so weird putting a MiG-21 and a MiG-15, but whatever. Uh, I wonder if we'll get guns on. Yep, your missiles don't work on me, bud. Oh. Yeah, I, I was kind of asking for that one, wasn't I? <laughs> Tempted fate a bit. This is a play and I do not want to take the head on with. Okay, so we can all agree that was ping and not my bad flying, right? I'm just taking the head on because I don't like this plane. Look, there we go, there we go. It's, it's the ping, I'm telling you. Like, genuinely. Alright, this should be a free kill, hopefully. No one's behind me. Yep. Oh, you're seriously? You're that petty? Oh wait, I think I just stole his kill. My brain was way too slow on that. Oh, he's gonna team kill me, isn't he? Just get it over with. No. Come on, I, I just feel bad now. Oh, I'm sorry. Wait, why on earth does this map look so big? 
Oh. Br oh no. I hate fighting bombers from like 4.0 upwards. But yeah. Oh. It just completely ignored all the cockpit armor, didn't it? Cool. These Spitfires do look really nice, don't they? Especially with the bigger cannons. Oh. What the hell? And moving on, it's time for two quick progress updates. One at 350 hours and one at 400, and you'll see why in a minute. Alrighty then, hello everyone. Um, I realized that I didn't make a progress update in the 100 days video, and I got a lot of comments on that also about premiums, so... I'm just going to clarify something really quickly here. I have three premiums on my account. I have not purchased any premium time. I have had 140 golden eagles the entire time. You can even go back into my 50 hours of War Thunder video and have a look if you really want to confirm it. But 150 golden eagles, the YA5M motor gunboat, which I tried to use to get footage for you guys, but I could not figure out how to use it for the life of me. Finally. Boat. <laughs> It's taken four minutes to try to find a match in naval. Oh, hey, there we go, as soon as I said it. I've got to hit my shots on this guy over here. If I don't, then I'm just going to give up, I reckon, because I've spent like 10 games trying to get this and I'm going insane. And that's why. Um, also a quick progress update. I bought a couple of planes because it's in the 50% sale. I bought some planes which I should have bought earlier and I'll probably spade them eventually. But what you guys are all wanting to see, probably the big boys. I've got the ME262A1A. I haven't played it very much because it's a bit of a miserable plane. But I've also got the HE162A1 as well fairly recently. Oh well, in the 50% discount event because I tried to grind for it. But I'm working on the MiG-15 BIS. And this is, I'm still going to be free to play, but it's a weird technicality because um, Gaijin stepped in to help. So I'm clarifying this now. I did 350 hours, completely free to play. I got jets. That's what I was aiming for. I'm actually really surprised that I got there as well. The grind wasn't as bad as everyone said it was. And hey, speaking of the partner program. I've got this now. I'm not actually sure if I'm allowed to show you guys it or not, but oh well. Actually, while we're, while we're here, we should probably buy some premiums for Germany. I don't know what premiums I'm going to buy, but we're going to figure that out, I guess. I've hated this thing from as soon as it was added and I played with it. Do I, do I succumb to, to the 288 spam? You know what? You can't beat them join them. Okay, cool. Um, because I don't really want a premium bomber, I am going to order a couple more premiums, because that would be funny. Um, there was one guy on my last video who commented, how dare you disgrace an American aircraft with an anime skin, or something like that. And the aircraft he was talking about was not, in fact, American. It was the TAR 152H, which I do have an anime skin on. So, I think I can get an anime skin on this one, but... This one goes out to you! Hold on, now I gotta find an anime skin for it. Okay, I wasn't actually expecting that to work. I don't know how to aim these guns. Eight thousand SL base from a kill. Wow. Okay. I can work with that. That is incredible. 13,000 SL from a single kill. What? Okay, so it is both. Yeah, both big boys. Cool. Wait, hold on. We just got 17,000 silver lines, didn't we? Oh my gosh. Alright, that's not even fair. 19,000. In one game, I bombed two bases. I'm in complete shock. I thought it was going to be good. This good? No. Oh my gosh. Wow. Genuinely just wow. 
I've just kind of been sitting here in shock for a couple of minutes, realizing what this means, but I'm I'm gonna if if I continue up that ray, the MiG-15 bis is mine in five games. Five. Because I've been enjoying this game for about 350 hours now, and this this is gonna be my ticket to actually getting to top tier. Because I don't know if I could have kept up the grind free to play, but just wow, honestly. Yeah. There's not much else to say. Alright, so I'm going to give you a really quick overview of the air tree, because I know by my analytics, most of you don't care that much. But we've got a lot more vehicles now. I have 93 out of 93 vehicles and 67 spaded. And as you can see, I've actually been playing quite a bit for Germany, so I've got all these shiny little medals. And the highest vehicles I've got is the Lim 5 p the ME 262 C1A, and I haven't purchased it, but I can get the ME 163B, and that's all thanks to this thing, which is an absolutely insane grinder. You can make like over 100,000 silver lines in a 20 minute game, which is nuts. As you can see, I got to about a million SL at one point, not quite, I was at like 800,000 or something, and then I got down almost to zero by buying all of these high tier planes, and now I'm back up like within the same week. It is absolutely nuts. But this is how far I am in the aviation tree. This is how far I am in the ground tree. It is a little bit miserable. But I haven't been having the best time in ground, and I'll get to that later. And this is what I've been this is the loadout I've been using in ground RB. I'm probably just gonna get this when I unlock it and then slap it in the extra crew slot over there. So please bully me in the comments for this lineup because it probably isn't good and make fun of all of the horrible decisions I have made in getting these two premiums instead of oh you should have got this one or this one or this one or blah blah blah. So yeah, feel free to make fun of me ruthlessly for that. And I have also acquired the Puramurski and I have been putting that to good use also in the Swedish tree. As you can see I've grinded out quite a lot of it. I would like to get the two vampires this thing because it looks kind of funny. And I also want to get the Vigan at some point because there's a, apparently there's a meme about this in the War Thunder community and I figured it would be kind of funny just to, you know, fly around at the Vigan. But that's besides my point. That's the Yacht Vigan, whatever, shut up. And looking at the US tray, I haven't progressed much. I have purchased the 109F4 on the American side and I probably will use that to grind out some of this a lot later down the line because I do want to, like, you know... Tomcat and when the F-16's added and I do want to kind of have fun with the Harriers and even this thing. But I'll do that sometime later and what you're probably staring at is this thing here, the Firebird. It's supposed to be a rank 75 premium which you have to buy in the Battle Pass. I have it for 14 days. And I realize because most of you won't be able to get it, I will do my due diligence and I'll test this thing out for you. Also, we got the toilet bomb. But that's what I've got to in my lineup so far, so let's get on with the rest. I also recorded my first few games in the MiG-15 bis, but for the sake of time, I'll just sort of summarize the entire thing in a couple clips. And teammates missiled some, another teammate. Nice. The base is 60 kilometers away. I don't know which one the fuel one is because I don't speak Russian. It's it's 47 kilometers away and we've got seven seconds of fuel left. I've watched some videos on this and all I've really gained out of it is don't point your ass at a sea vixen. We are mad compressed and he is still faster than us. Now he's going to run back to the airfield. I don't have fuel. I didn't look at that. Please kill the sea vixen. I don't have long for this world. We did nothing all game. And time for the pain to start again. Oh, it's just a sea vixen. That isn't a sea vixen. Turn, turn, turn. <gasps> oh, okay, ping. Oh, That was beautiful. Yeah, what now, bud? Uh-oh. 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 Turn, 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 turn. How do I dodge that? Literally, how do I dodge it? 
And before I get into the next bit, which a lot of you have been waiting for for quite some time now, I just want to take a second to say, please can you subscribe to the channel? Now while I could throw up a big scary graph or analytics which show just how pitiful my subscribe rate is, I just want to say I put my heart, soul, and hundreds of hours into these videos, and you guys subscribing, liking the video, and commenting down below is pretty much the only thing that actually keeps this channel alive. So if you haven't done so already, please do. It allows me to make the content that I enjoy making, and it allows you guys to enjoy the videos. And if you have done so, thank you so much. You're pretty much the only reason why I'm sitting in a dark room right now talking to myself. That sounded kind of bad, actually. You know what, let's just get on with tanks. Now, I want to say, this is my early experience with Ground RB. I didn't actually want to do this, really. I, there's been a ton of comments, and that's been, you know, pretty much the only reason why I've done this. I didn't really have any other external motives at all. Um, yeah, well, let's get on with it then, because I want to get into my thoughts with this, because I have quite a few. But before I can discuss my thoughts on this mode and how it's better than Air RB in every single way possible, I gotta get you guys on the same page as me, so enjoy some highlights and lowlights of it before we get into my thoughts. Just gonna sneak up on this car. He's completely AFK. He's just vibing. Oh, sorry. Ow. Um, let's just dip back a bit, maybe, then. Uh, and light it up. Whoa! Get off me, get off me. I'm just gonna try to get a kill before I die, then. Um, it's got a really bad aim. Oh, this guy. Sorry, bud. Oh. <laughs> I think there's someone down there. Oh, that's an enemy for sure. These MGs do like nothing. I probably switched. Oh. <gasps> oh. I am speed. No one's gonna be here before me. Oh, he's also speed. Um, this is awkward. Can I? Bye. Another unsuccessful bombing run. Let's go. Just gonna hit a smooth landing. Oh, that's the wrong way. Um, let's just easy does it. Oh no 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 no! Ah, uh, uh, I'll take it. No, piss off. Ah, uh, how do you get a Spitfire this early? I literally just rushed a point in the Puma, and this is the only reason I'm in this thing. Why did you take a Spitfire? And how are you already on my side? Okay, whatever. I'm getting my revenge. I've got an SPA available. Give me it, give me it, give me it, give me it. His ass is mine. Where? They're nearby. There he is. Flick. And then light him up. Light him up. Light him up. Get him! What are you doing? Let's go! Alright, so this is me in editing. I'm slowing this down because I didn't actually realize what had happened at the time, but I killed the wrong person. Keep watching. So I'm trying to hit the Spitfire, but I'm under leading right now. And if you watch, this Russian plane on the left is going to perfectly fly into my bullets, and I kill him and think it's the Spitfire. Honestly, it just makes this clip like 20 times better. This is easily the best part of Grand RB. Oh, this is gonna be juicy. Oh, oh well. I'll get the other two in a second. Oh, I love revenge bombing. It's the only thing that makes the mode worth it. Ah! Piss off. Let me get my bomb. Please. Oh gonna be perfect. I don't actually have a delay, but that's alright. Please die. Please die. Oh no. Yeah, I'm dead. And he killed himself with his bombs! <laughs> oh, 
Oh, fuck. Turn, turn, turn. Okay, that's a good start. Okay, he's not dead. How is he not dead? Uh, what? No way. Oh no. Reload, reload, reload. Wait, what? It didn't let me shoot. Okay. Uh, I think this will be alright. Wait, can I hear someone? Oh. Wait. Oh, that's so stupid. Okay. I get a couple of seconds of vulnerability, so I just kill him. Oh my god, you're joking. This game is so shit. Why is he allowed to be there? Like, that, it's actually so dumb. Anyone here? Hello? Oh, there he is. And you're gone. Bullshit. Alright, this will be an easy kill. What? What just happened? Am I like hitting him wrong or something? And this guy's about to be gone. <sighs> Are you serious? I hear one. Oh, yep, there he is. Should be easy. There's another one, isn't there? Yeah. What the hell just happened? I don't really like this map, it's way too open. Uh, who's that? Oh, just teammate. I can, I can make it over that, right? Yeah, it'll be easy. Oh. I'm stuck now, aren't I? Yeah. Come here, you can run, but you can't hide. Alright, how doesn't that kill everyone? It's a literal SPAA. Oh my god, you're joking. Ah! Oh, well, I lived through that. Where is he? What? Am I this blind? He should be like right there, right? How did he get an angle? Am I, like, missing something? Uh... Where? There- no, there's no way. Wait. He was just- Am I that blind? There's someone around the corner, but I can't, um, get them, because they're just going to shoot me. Uh, I think he's moving back, so if I can just, yeah, I should be good to take the shot. What? Oh, for fuck's sake. Please die. Oh, fuck off, you dumb. Nice f***ing team playing, moron. You are the reason why this mode isn't fun for me. Go f- Um... Oh, great. I've just spawned for context. If you look at the map, you'll see. This is fun. I don't even- Where is he? Ah. Oh. Um, I haven't loaded a shot, so if there's someone around this corner, I'm just sort of dead. Oh, there's a plane. Ah. Oh. Yeah. Is Turn. Turn. Turn, please. How is that? That's a heavy tank. It shouldn't be going that fast. What's the point of having armor if your gun doesn't work? Uh, I'm done for today. I don't even want to play anymore.
This mode isn't fun. And now, after playing tanks for a bit, I can safely say that I was really missing out and that, is, that it is objectively more fun than air in every single way possible. <laughs> oh, I'm not fooling anyone, am I? So to all of those people who have been saying Stockholm Syndrome with War Thunder, I never really understood it that much because I enjoyed the game until I started playing Ground RB. And I'm gonna be honest, the mode just isn't very fun. In air, when you die, in most cases you did something wrong and you can learn from your mistakes. In ground, you got shot from 9 kilometers away, your bullet did absolutely nothing for some reason, they saw you first, or their armor is just too strong for you to penetrate for some reason, which is actually a laughably bad mechanic from Gaijin. And hey, while we're talking about laughably bad mechanics, I'm not going to cut this any slack. Close air support runs absolutely rampant, and SBAA is actually really bad to try to counter it. Spawn camping is abysmal, and it's entirely because of how Gaijin designed the maps. Now, I will try to grind to about rank 3 or 4 in Germany, where it's apparently the strongest, but at the end of the day, the issue is the fact that whoever sees you first kills you, unless you get lucky and their shot does nothing, which happens to me a lot, so... And then I had a chat with some people on my Discord server, and I realized that the reason why my bullets were doing nothing isn't because of how bad the mode is. It's because I was using the wrong shell type. I am not even joking, I had a 2 out of 3 chance to choose a shell that would do something, and I picked the 1 in 3, of course. It literally had even less penetration power than I do. <laughs> uh, why does YouTube pay me to do this? But all jokes aside, now that my shots can actually kill people, the mode's alright. I mean, the spawns still aren't protected though, I mean, come on, it's, it's really just bad game design. And hey, speaking of bad game design, time to get into the Gaijin moments. And before we get into the Gaijin moments, I have a large folder inside of the Gaijin folder, and it's just titled AAA, and if you've played ARRB for any amount of time over the past month, I have a feeling you'll know what I'm talking about. So what you're seeing now is a laughably bad mechanic designed by Gaijin of me just getting killed over and over and over. And I don't want to go much deeper into this because it makes me kind of regret building my channel on a game with laughably bad mechanics such as this. So let's just get into the rest of them. Wait, did that Zero just go Super Sonic? And the AI just killed itself again. Wait. Didn't I just spin this? It's the same thing. Okay, no. What's, what's going on? Gaijin, what have you done? Wait, there isn't a single fighter on our team. <laughs> oh, I'm aware that I'm contributing to this by buying this thing, but still. That's actually really funny. <laughs> the joys of the JU-288, everyone. What? The propeller, look at it. It's just... Huh? I thought the engine had died or something. Okay. Um. Cool. Uh. Gaijin, I don't think there's a battlefield. Are you good? I don't know what the hell has happened here, but... I think... I think the Russian heavy tank is giving birth. Uh... Either that or am I watching vehicular intercourse? Someone just flew right into our airfield. Wait, that was an AI, I just realized. What on earth? 
I am so confused. And now that we've got the great game design out of the way, I want to try something different this time, so I've compiled a bunch of bonus clips which I usually would have cut from the video, so if you enjoy, let me know in the comments. First game, let's go! 9.0, wait, what's that? Wait, is that on my screen? Is that- oh, that's the radar? Oh, what are you doing? See ya! This game was way too good. Oh, we got Hero of the Sky. Yeah, this is why I don't play arcade. Like, I, I'm just bullying children. Like, it's it's not even fair. <laughs> 13 air kills! It's... <laughs> I think my mic's broken in Discord. So I'm gonna keep playing, I'll fix it later. Uh, yeah, okay. I, we should have the speed to pull into this guy. Come on, these guns are so bad. Holy frame rate as well. Uh, let's just get this kill. No way. I was literally just talking about this in Discord. There's no shot! I just realized my game sound's been broken for like... the past like... 10, 20 hours maybe, so I'm gonna have to fix that later. Oh, so if there's a bunch of clips in this video with no sound, now you know why, because I'm a complete dumbass. Uh... Oh well. I think we're in a full up, yeah, because there's an AVA, so it's a full up tier this game. Yippee! Well, speaking of dumbasses, you ready for just everyone to start saying, yep, awesome, awesome? <laughs> there's the confusion, bravo, awesome! <laughs> well done! <laughs> oh, I'll say it as well. Oh my gosh. Oh, I love this game so much. <laughs> I have not done, like, shit this life. Like, I've just been trying to... I've been going too fast to actually, like, get any kills. Oh, I think... Th Are we going too fast? Stop. 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 Please. Now we're fine. We're fine, I reckon. No, we are definitely not fine. Um, I have a minute of fuel. I'm actually going to have to try to clutch this. Surely. Um, flaps. I got to fix the flaps. Uh, the stupid engine's overheating as well. Alright, well, we can take a bit of damage, I think. Please, just lift off. Lift off. We're, we're going to hit... Oh... Please, go up, go up, go up. I'm gonna- yes, okay, gear up, quickly. This is gonna be horrifying. We're gonna have to barely land it as well when we get back on the runway. Please. 27, 26, 25. This fuel is dropping so scarily quick. Please, that's the runway, like, right there, though. We can make it, I'm sure, I'm sure. Come on, how are we going to line this up? Because we're going to have to belly land this, so we're going to have to slow down a bit. I'll throttle down. Ten seconds left. This is going to be really close. I think we got this, we just got to slow down. Yeah, let's go! We actually did it! We actually did it! What?! No fucking way! No, I'm off for the day. And this is a bit of a weird tangent, but I found someone from the community who's been around for quite a while in-game now, and I promised him a shout-out, so if you want to see how German planes are actually supposed to be used, go have a look. And also, if you do see me in-game, say hi, because it is really wholesome. I, I wrote a blog post a while ago about why I f***ing hate video games, because this is what it does, it appeals to, like the male fantasy- Alright, I think it's about karaoke time, let's go. <laughs> 
So just remember, anyone who didn't watch the end of this video just missed out on that. Hey, you've made it to the end, finally. This video was a lot longer than all of the other ones, so I'm probably going to try to move it back down to 100 hours again. And if you don't know what I mean by that, the 100 days video, I was going to try to keep it to around 300, 350 hours. But it was, in all, in all honesty, it was probably more like 283 or something around there. And I just had to use the first Jet gameplay to pad the watch time a little. But hey, it worked and it's the most popular video on my channel now. So, I mean, I'll take it. But if you have stuck around for this long, thank you so much. Um, I had a ton of content to get through. And if you did manage to get through all of it, then hopefully that means I've improved my pacing, which is what I was trying to focus on this video. But all of that aside, if you have a friend who might enjoy this video, please share it with them. And I have another video coming up in December which should explain as to why this video was delayed so late and also why there won't be much more content until the new year starts. And yeah, just stick around for that. It'll explain a lot more. And if you could also follow me on Twitch, I'm going to start streaming at the beginning of the new year, so that would be greatly appreciated. And if I go radio silent on Discord, it's because I'm moving houses, so just keep that in mind. Anyways, thank you so much for sticking around this long. I love you all, and I'll see you next time, hopefully. Goodbye.